Hey guys and with the year 2019 Google is now all set to announce the 10th version of Android and that is Android Q. There have been many reports and leaks about the new features. Also during the developer conference 2018, Google officially announced a few new features that we might see in the next Android software. So these are the officially happening things but let's talk about my wish list of what feature Google should add to make Android Q a better operating system. First off this pie navigation is really annoying. I didn't even think twice before switching to the old navigation system on my Pixel 2 XL and the recently updated Motorola One Power. So this definitely needs to change. And I'm not saying the whole navigation system should be dropped, but at least change the way to open recents and the launcher. It's really annoying, guys. Next feature that should be a part of 10th Android version is this network blocker for a particular application. It's not a custom feature. This thing was posted by a Reddit user as a concept and it's actually available in the Oxygen OS but in a different form. This thing basically enables or disables network including Wi-Fi or data for a particular application. So that's really a useful feature. Like if you want to block data access for WhatsApp or for Instagram, you won't get these notifications. Actually Google needs to borrow a lot of feature from Oxygen OS, the smoothness, app opening animation. and closing animation these things are important to make your operating system speedy and that's where OnePlus wins this race also including Apple iPhones are great in terms of RAM management they need to include that feature also next up the important feature requested by most of you guys is the inbuilt application lock these things are actually available in all the custom UI smartphones Xiaomi Samsung and even OnePlus with Oxygen OS that is stock Android has this feature And again it's not any custom feature cause you already get fingerprint sensor or face id in your smartphone so why not use it for all the applications instead of just unlocking the smartphone itself from the lock screen i mean you just can use the same feature for different applications and google needs to enable this next up there should be a feature for notification animation for the lock screen like there's a cool application called notification available for iOS smartphones and it looks really amazing not every smartphone comes with a notification led so there must be a sort of animation for the lock screen by the way guys if you're enjoying this video quickly hit that like and subscribe button cause that is really going to help me a lot and finally it's time for the official face recognition feature it's still not available for pixel smartphones or any android one smartphone i mean at least with android q it's the perfect time to dominate ios with an inbuilt face id feature yeah i know it's not going to be as perfect as that in iphone 10 cause they use hardware still with the perfect software it will be quite secure so definitely it's time for the face id for the android smartphones next up i really like the about section settings of the android pie in oneplus smartphones i mean it's as simple as that you get the image of the smartphone itself with sorted about section looks really impressive and clean while on the other hand the current android pie settings is totally messed up you need to open multiple settings in order to get to the about section and at last where is the treble support what brands are doing even after implementing project treble there is no faster updates things are going slow and slow google you said that we are going to get the fastest updates with the implementation of project treble It's same as before nothing has changed at this point with Android Q you should at least do something about this security patches and the slow updates this is getting really annoying even the smartphones with stock android runs android oreo right now we have the new Zenfone Max Pro M2 running oreo the Moto Z3 flagship smartphone you said that with the project treble we'll be getting the latest updates and fastest updates and it's not happening So the official beta will be starting from March 2019 as always and according to the latest reports Google is also planning to announce the Pixel 3 Lite and Pixel 3 Lite XL so let me know what features you want Google to implement in Android Q there are going to be tons of developer previews and Google is planning for a major redesign both in terms of performance and user interface so thanks for watching this video hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to like subscribe and peace out